Now we'll create the RFC port. Transition code for creating the RFC port is WE21. The RFC port is created on top of the RFC destination of receiver system, which we have created in the previous step. It defines technical characteristics between the SAP system and the other system. It also defines the medium in which the data is exchanged between the system. Here also, we can see the multiple options like the transactional RFC, file, CPI, web PI, XML file, etc. So for SAP to SAP for our early, we'll go with the TRFC port. And the transition code for this is WE21. So let's log into SAP system and create a RFC port on top of the RFC destination which we have created in the previous step. So log in to go to our SAP system. Transition code is WE21. Here select the transition RFC that is TRFC port. Click on create. So we have two options. And the port name can be generated automatically or we can provide the own port number. So I'm going with the first one that is generate port name. Press enter. So you can see the port number that is A0000004. System is creating this port number. With the description here like 400 REC receiver. And in the RSC destination, we have to enter the RSC destination which we have created in the previous steps that is D400 RECV enter and save note down this port number so very small step creating of RFC port but very important part so in this way we done with the creation of RFC port now next we will see how to create a model view.